Hello, everyone. My name is Jennifer DeFore. I'm a triple silver with Archer and Evolution. I've been here since the end of August. Um, I am on Team Eclipse and I am from Texas. Uh, today, we're going to learn about Jot Form. It's where you can get a vac vacation request form for your clients. It's really easy to send out. We have a template for you, which makes it even easier. So we're going to go ahead and I'm going to share my screen with y'all. Hmm. Let me get my Zoom stuff out of the way. Okay, so the website we are going to use is JotForm. So if you want to go here, we you need to create an account. You can sign up with Google, Facebook, or with an email. I suggest using an email, not with Facebook. Um, I already have a Google account, so we're going to log in. Come on. There we go. Okay, so this is JotForm. When you get here, you have options. You can create a form from scratch. You can search templates. For the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna search templates and we are gonna search, you deserve a vacation. When you search, you deserve a vacation, this first uh, template that pops up you're gonna click on it. This has all the information that you could or need for a client. So we're gonna press use. Sorry, there's a bug flying in my face. And then we're going, you can edit it from here. So <clears throat> over here where the little paintbrush was or paint roller, you can change the colors of everything. So if you wanna change the background color, you can change it to whatever you want, whatever. I mean, if you're, so my form ha, or my logo has specific colors. So I do it towards that. You can also choose an image, um, whatever you've downloaded, you can put in a link to an image, whatever you can, you can change it up and make it your own. When you click on something that's already here, it's gonna bring up its properties. So if you, this isn't your logo, you wanna put your own logo, you can do remove and you can upload a file to put there. Um, I already have my logo here, so I'm gonna select it and put my travel agency logo there. Everything you do, you wanna make sure that you are personalizing to your, agency to your brand. So then you can go through here and you can look at all the questions that they have. It's all ready for you. Um, you can edit it how you want. So if you don't like uh, how something's worded, you can click on it and it'll bring up all the information over here and you can type. So you can add whatever, I mean, whatever you want there. And it has the ones that are required. If something's not required and you would like it to be required, if you click on it, so like the type of room is not a required thing, it has a little button right here where you can make it required. And it'll put the little red star there for you. If you don't like something, um, so like this one comes with, are you interested in becoming a travel agent? If you don't want that on there, you can just remove it and it goes away. So you can edit these, do whatever you want with these to make them your own and make them pretty, but this is a good form to have to send to clients so that you know exactly what they're looking for. You can rename it. You can decide where it's going to go once someone fills, fills it out. So this is important because if you're not checking jot form every day and you don't have an email set up, it's not gonna go anywhere and you won't know that someone filled it out. So add your email in here. So you get an email when someone fills out a form. There's a thank you page afterwards that you can edit as well and have it say, you know, whatever you want. 
This one says, thank you, your submission has been received. You can add in, um, we will get back with you shortly. You know, you can make it your own. That's the most important thing. And then we're gonna go to publish. That's the last little option over here. You can copy this link. I copy this link and put it on my Facebook post when I do mock bookings. Um, you can share it on Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn. You can do a QR code. There's all kinds of stuff. There's also a an app for this. So you can download JotForm on your phone and have the form with you at all times. So you can copy it and send it to someone or they can scan the QR code to send it to, you know, to fill it out. So you can always have it with you if you stumble across clients anywhere. Um, sorry, my Zoom is being weird. Do we have any questions so far? No way. Okay, so the other cool thing about JotForm is you can create a form from scratch. So, oh, I already have all my forms. So I created this one right here, let me. Let me delete that one, there we go. I created a group vacation request form. I took all the information from the regular vacation request form and put it on a group one and added things to it. So I added how many travelers there are. And I have a, a thing for children, adults and children, so that they can tell me how many of each, how many rooms they would like. Um, I also put on here, who is the point of contact? for the group vacation. So you can go in here and you can play around with it and add what you would like, take off what you would like. The cool thing about this is you can make these things move. So you see how big this one is? You can go to the advanced properties over here and you can shrink it and make it smaller and you can move it around. Okay, and you have all these things over here that you can add. You can add a heading, you can add a name, you can add, so let's see, I have this right here, that's the full name one. You have email option, you have address, phone, you have the date picker, which is right here. Um, you have, if they wanna set up an appointment with you, if that's something you wanna do. You have where you can have them sign it. And then you have, these are the question options down here. So you have short text, which is considered this one. You have long text where it puts in a box for more of a paragraph. You have an actual paragraph where you can type out something. You have drop down options. So drop down options will be like this. Are your dates flexible? and you put yes, no, whatever. Um, you have single choice, you have multiple choice, which is like this, where you can add, they can choose flight, hotel, car, Disney, all, you know, if they want everything, they can put it in there. You have a number option. You can put in an image, you can connect a file. Um, you can, do a CAPTCHA to make, you know, make sure they're actually human. You can do the spinner, which is the, where they select the amount. And you can change your submit button or you can add a submit button. But there's all kinds of options here for what you can do. And once again, you can change all the colors and everything over here. You can also preview the form. So if you press preview, this is what your client will see. If they're on a desktop computer, they have a phone option 
and they have a tablet option just so that you can see how it looks in each form, which is good because sometimes things get squished weirdly on phones compared to computers and we don't want anything to look squishy. And then once again, you'll just publish. So if I copy this link and I put it right here in the chat box, everyone should be able, able to click on that and fill it out. You can also invite someone by email to fill it out if you wanna do it that way. But it's a great tool to have to send to clients, to know exactly what they want and to be able to look back on it without having to go through text messages or emails or anything like that. Does anyone have any questions so far? Any questions? I have a question. Yes, ma'am. So I was just wondering, um, you said you send this out to um, your clients after you get ready to book with them. I mean, if they're ready to book with you, just at like a pre-screener to what it is yeah. exactly. So when you look at the You Deserve a Vacation form, it has on there. So first of all, there's something that says, give us at least 45 or 48 hours to get back with you. And if a deposit is needed, can you do that? Um, it has a how you hear about us, but then it has all their important information, like what kind of what kind of vacation they want. If they want a cruise or an all-inclusive resort, a hotel, if they need airfare, if they need a rental car, Disney vacations on here, because that's a whole nother category besides all of this, right? And then there's other. So if they wanted like, they want to go to the mountains to ski, you know, they could put something like that in there. How many travelers? How many rooms? The types of accommodations that they want. So if they wanted um, a suite in a hotel, they could put that there. How many adults? How many children? It has all the important stuff that you need to do a quote for a client on this form. So yes, send it to clients when they reach out to you and say, hey, I'm thinking about vacation. Can you help me out? You can send this to them and get a better idea of what they want, have it for your records and be able to look back on it when you are trying to build a quote. Thank you. You're welcome. Anyone else have any questions? Everyone know how to find the You Deserve a Vacation template? Okay, if y'all don't have any questions, that is all I have for you today. I hope y'all have a great day. And once again, if you have any questions, let me know.